Alright, we are back and we are playing Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Valhalla! We're going to continue on with this. This has um, been pretty good All so right. far. But where yes, are we? It's a pretty cool game. We made it to the back to the village yeah but what is this it's probably loading up oh, oh okay what are we doing i don't know is this you or is this like a continuation of i don't know i keep playing this because i don't recognize this scene at all i don't know that was weird oh okay. i'll come home okay speak to gonna the blacksmith where are you, Gunnar? You are 73 meters that way. Hornberg. meters. Open the skill menu to apply skill points. Open skill menu. Mm. Where are my skill points? Okay. I think they are here. Okay, we are back. And I need to get to the blacksmith. Check on track quests by opening the quest log. You look like you know a thing or two about dice. Come! Is the king free to speak with me? He is still with the emissary from the north. I would wait a while longer. Understood. I will come back. Okay. That's what I thought I was doing. Hello, Eivor. Hi. Do you know where the blacksmith is? Come and drink! Let us amuse the gods! Where the fuck is the blacksmith? Blacksmith be by the stable? Show nearby quest. Okay. I think I'm going the right way now. Nope. Oh, that's probably where the king is, right? The blue. Is there no one who will go around with me? All right, Tekla. 
I'll outdrink you. This land will never prosper while clan battles clash. Who would like to hear a story? Who would enjoy a tale of the gods? There has always been war, he is. even among hey, the gods. When Midgard... Wolf kissed. Welcome back. Gunnar, I have something here you might like to see. Thunderclap of Thor! Is that your father's axe? I have not seen this beauty since of well. Thor. For some time, <laughs> I forged this weapon long ago. Still looks good. One of my finest, I think. It has a blunted blade, but it swings well. Can you sharpen it? I can give it a better edge and reinforce the handle. And as luck would have it, I have one ingot left for the job. Are you sure? The fates have will it so. But in future, bring your own metal ingots. I cannot forge them from empty air. Okay. That's a nice bald head you got there, Gunner. I don't know why you turned your back on me like that. Guess you're done talking. Oh, it's pretty, ne? Flawless bearded axe. Okay. That should do it. Anything else? Oh, okay, you were busy working on my axe. I see why you turned away from me. Thought you were just being rude. Uh. Need anything else? Uh. And how are you, Gunnar? Holding up? Yeah, work is good, and my spirits are strong, but my nights are newly cold. My lady left me, if you have not heard. I had. Sorry to hear it. You were together how long? Uh, five weeks, it was. <laughs> five beautiful, passionate weeks. But all that is done. Will I never find my Brunhilde? Valkyries do not walk the world as they once did, Gunnar. Maybe set your sights a bit lower. <laughs> lower? My friend, look at my wares, my weapons. I'm not a man to settle for less than the finest of anything. That's all for now. Return any time. Okay, I'm down. Okie dokie. Spit to Ramsey. Now, I will go over here. Oh no. What is my quest? That was easy enough. Uh huh. Okay. And. Speak to Ranvi. It's the next thing you gotta do. Okay. I will do it. Where well, are you, to talk to him about, But we need to speak to him, apparently. Maybe we just want to say hi. Hi, Ranvi. They must be finished now. If you have any other business, yeah. it may be wise to do it now. Let him cool down. I could speak to Volker first. Get this weight off my mind. The king is not going anywhere. Okay. Okay. <laughs> the sea 
here lives in the mountains north of Fornberg. Hey, Tekla, what is brewing? Alvis tells me this brew is too strong. Think you can handle a few rounds? Gulveg of the Vanyan was killed and burned. Not once, but three times. And reborn as Freya, mother of the Voller. In a war that came out, echoes through the nine worlds still. Midgarda would drown and the blood spill. And their dead would hide the sun. Those bravely fallen, now bound, wait for him to blow the Fjallarhorn. And some of them one last time. Losses on both sides. Now each go to attacks from Jotnar and other monsters. So Odin, in his wisdom, proposed truth and marriage to the war witch Freya. Oaths were made, horns were raised, and from the gods, Mikos was born. Wiser than Odin himself, this was the same Kvasir whose stolen blood became the root of poetry. But that is another story. Oh. Think you can match horns with me? Hmm? I could outstring every one of you. Don't feel bad. Most of these backgrounds would have pissed themselves all past by now. Come and drink. Let us amuse the gods. That might have not been the best idea. Now he's all drunk. And weeble wobbly. And blurry. <laughs> we need to see the seer's solace. Oh. <laughs> now where is the seer's solace? Said she's in the mountains. In the mountains. North of Fornberg. Do I need to get on the boat? I don't know. I don't think so. Oh. I just you need to walk. In your state. Drunk man climbing a snowy mountain. Doesn't sound like the best idea. No one who will go around with me? We went around with you. Around. Oh shit. He just be climbing everything. Rocky wall, no problem. Mountain! <laughs> 471 <Damn>. meters. <laughs>
and he's drunk on top of it. <laughs> yeah. Four hundred and twenty three more feet. Is the horse going to come and get me <coughs> off the mountain? How do you call the horse anyway? Huh? Get on the mountain! Go! Can I kill the horse? I don't know. He said don't have him jump off the cliff. This horse will be tired than a motherfucker. That's telling you what direction to go. I'm following right. it. Right? There you go. So now you're like going the right way. But... There's a little like house or something down there, isn't there? Where? Right ahead. Where do you see a house at? Like some kind of little castle thing like that? Oh, I see it. Maybe that's where we're going. Ram. Balka. Hush. I need silence to hear the songs of nature. Hamuram. Hamuram. Svala. She gives praises and she is greeted. For your hearing, I hearken. O oh, ancient ones, great Odin, great Freya, I give you thanks for your gift of Seder. She gives thanks, and she is blessed. 
Eivor, it has been some time. What brings you so far to see me? I... I have come for your advice. On a private matter. Come. Is your mother well? Her mind is a jumble. She speaks to spirits. I fear her final winter has come. But she has me. Now, let us speak to your needs. I have had a vision. A powerful vision. It may have been my battle lust, or a delirium caused by the cold, but... Describe it for me. After 17 years, I saw my father's axe again. And when I touched it, the vision came on fast. There was a wolf howling in fears. And then a figure, a gray beard in a cloak with a single eye. He bid me follow him. Ah, the high one. He calls to you. Perhaps he means to speak with you, deliver a message. Only through Seder will you see more clearly and unravel the threats that sit tangled upon your mind. This will not take long. Have you used this sort of magic before? I have no fear. It was not my satyr that made her like this. Her condition inspired the elixir. Did it help her? For a time, it opened her up to visions. Strange, unreadable things. Then she returned to her current state. Drink. Mm -hmm. I already been if you drinking. Seek true understanding. Oh, this tastes like dookie. Ugh. Oh. Night night. She just killed me. <laughs> Bitch, I think we have some fentanyl in there. Don't go towards the light! Uh-oh. Uh, uh, oh. Uh get, your, get your axe out! Huh? I saw nothing, Volka. Felt nothing. Harvey! Mm -hmm. Harvey! Harvey! I walk among the dead. Yo, you go. Sigurd. Sigurd. Brother, when did you arrive? Where are you going?
understand that. The wolfie got my brother and took him to the light. Ah, oh, oh, oh. oh. Eivor, it is Valka. I am here. Hey, Valka. Gods, I thought I... What was that? Who? Tell me everything. I, I, I was on a mountain in a, in a violent blizzard, climbing toward the summit, following a, a wolf. Mm hmm. Oh. The wolf beckoned? Which one? Odin. Who's Odin? I saw I Odin know. and the Nornir spinning the threads of fate. They were watching me. Mm, not watching. They were showing you the way forward. Your life. Your path. What lies before you and where it ends. The wolf. Beckoned. And the wolf was eager for my attention, as if it were beckoning me to follow. You are the wolf kissed, fated to carry its mark for life. In this case, it might represent your ambition mm. or your fear. Mm -mm. Mm. Not my fear. I saw the gates to Odin's Hall of Slain Champions. They opened for me. Shades of Valhalla. Valhalla. For which you are destined. Valhalla. She says it nice. Valhalla. I do not know what else to say. My, my memories are faint. Hazy. Did you reach the summit of this mountain? I did, yes. Sigurd was there. Wounded. In pain. His fighting arm was missing. Then the wolf reappeared. The size of a dragon. Twisted and terrible. It fixed its eyes on me and... Struck. Then I awoke. The gods favor you, Eivor. They always have. You will have your glory, and you will earn your place in Valhalla. Valhalla. But these portents carry a darker truth. The missing arm, the trail of blood, the beast. You will betray your brother, Sigurd. Mm -mm. That is the meaning of your vision. Mm -mm. That cannot be right. I would never betray Sigurd. He's my brother, my family. The Nordnir have spoken, and this is their message. No, this is wrong. Oh, you misunderstand. That cannot be right. You will betray Sigurd. Odin fought against his fate. It can be done. I don't accept it. You are wrong! And that's my final answer. Come on, horsey. Let's go home. Oh, I got more skill points! Nice! Okay. Fast travel. Returning to your settlement. I need to go to another quest. Okay, what do I do? I need to go speak to Ranvi. I'm to return home and face your stepfather's fury. He should be cooled down by now. Hopefully. I'm going up. Yeah. Going back over the mountain. Oh. So I'm supposed to go this way. I guess. I mean. Oh, not that way. So, Ivan is asleep on his watch. That would explain some things. What? So, 
So Ivan is asleep on his watch. That would explain some things. Tudo vai rolar. I made it. Oh, <laughs> he almost knocked her off the bridge. No, she was, she was just acting weird. Is she drunk. Yeah, she been drinking that shit. Do nothing to her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is where I need to be at, right? What? What kind of shit you talking? She show cussed me out, didn't she? There's the chick, right? Jump off your horse. Come! Huh? They must be finished now. The king has called for his best mead, so the talks are concluded. It should be safe to enter. I'm ready to face the thunder. I will speak with the king now. Uh oh. Excellent, King Stephen. I will take this proposal to my nephew. I believe he will see the wisdom in it. Good. It is all I can hope for. May the. Uh -uh. May the winds favor your voyage, Githormer. Eivor, come forward and explain in plain words why you have willfully disobeyed my commands. Do you mock me? I do not mock you, King. I mean to embolden you against your enemies and your own poor judgment. You know nothing of my judgment. You know nothing of my plans and strategies. Sigurd would agree with me. My son might agree with you, but he would obey me. He knows his place. Not as well as he knows his father. Imagine you are harassed by an enemy with warriors that vastly outnumber your own. What profit does open war bring? Would it not be better to work quietly through diplomacy, gaining alliances? Waiting until the day our numbers outweigh our enemies and our victory is guaranteed. Do 
we have any allies to speak of? Or is that your excuse to do nothing? Your confidence blinds you to so much in plain sight, Eivor. Day and night I toil to forge ties with clans to the north. Very soon you will see the fruits of my efforts. Only then will you understand. Is that all? Motherfucker. I'm at a loss with you, Eivor. When I took you in as my own, never did I imagine such disrespect from the child of Varin. Your father was a fine man. Just and loyal to me, he died bravely so that we might live. He died a coward, Lord. A fate I will not mirror. Why do you carry such a useless burden? Let it go! Think only of the days to come, of your future and the victories at hand. My honor has been stained. <clears throat> Until it's wiped clean, I want nothing else. I refuse to pick at that wound again. But if there is something that can chase these shadows from your thoughts... Mm -mm. Sigurd has come! Down at the docks, his ship is here! Brother! Sigurd! Family matters. Quest complete. Sigurd! Radical Prince, new crest. Hey, careful with that one. Hey, boy! See you good? <laughs> oh, look at you, blood soaked drinker. What have you been worrying without me? Oh, and you, salt cured Vikinger. I smell the stink of a dozen kingdoms in your beard. <laughs> Just to start. Round thee, my dear wife. Your husband returns. Bringing gifts and riches to share. And new friends, I see. Yes. Basim and Hytham. We met in Miklagard, and they showed me her buried secrets. We are grateful to Sigurd for his invitation and eager to pay tribute to your king. My brother is always very careful with the company he keeps. If you're standing safely beside him. He must like you. Ah, Eva. Save the introductions until our bellies are full. I will see my father. Tell him of my time away. They don't look trustworthy. This morning we no traded shit. with a ship passing south. They told us Eivor the Wolf Kist was captured by Kyrtvis men. They must have cut the tale short. I killed my captors and recovered my crew. And for that your father scolded me. You know where I stand, brother. Nothing short of war will dislodge Kjotve from our lands. But he disagrees. I know. I know. Father thinks too much and acts too little. Today that changes. I promise you. By the winter's end, the name Kjotve the Cruel will be a curse on the lips of a drunken fool. My son! Welcome home! Uh, father... <coughs> Sigurd! Tonight we feast and celebrate your return, Sigurd. The tables are laid with barley and lamb, bread and mead. And mead. no more, I beg you. I want I nothing mead. you would not serve a thrall. Let me be the one to honor you. I bring gifts and tales from faraway lands. After two winters away, I am full up with both. Very well, very well. Come inside. And when we are fat and satisfied, father, we will talk of Kyrtve and his clan, and how we may end their terror once and for all. He has dogged us too long, shamed us for too many seasons. I know this. Eivor knows this. It ends now. Yes, of course, when the time is right. <laughs> Through Rusland we barreled down the Volga River, raiding as we went, shadowy tribes hurling spears at our ship. At Miklagard, 
We saw men bedecked in riches as vibrant as the Biverest itself. And these we took for our troubles, of course. We sailed to Rome, then Africa, past oceans of sand, warriors of all colors, and beauty the eyes must weep to behold. And now I have returned, with riches and glory to share with my family, my friends, my eyes for Strengir. So take what you desire from my horn. For this, this is only a taste of things to come. Tomorrow, the Raven Clan starts anew. Skull, Sigurd. Skull! And you, Eivor, come. I have something special for you. I thought long and hard on a gift worthy of you. You've snared my curiosity, brother. What is it? Not yet. Drinks first. <laughs> to my first night in Thornburg in over two winters, it must end with me soaked and wall-eyed, shouting at the shadows of trolls. And you want me to sail with you in these honey waves? Yes. You are stuck with me, Dringul. Now drink. Stuck with me, you jungler! <laughs> oh, you would put Thor to shame. You have been away too long, brother. You do not know the spiced kick of Tekla's meat. Mm. It does have a new taste. I like it. It is good to have you back, Sigurd. Yes. I've missed this terribly. When I first met Basin, I regaled him with tales of our homeland. And it was then I felt a hard longing to return at once. Come. <laughs> this brings us to your gift. These excellent men were my shepherds through much of their homeland, the Abbasid Caliphate. They are a clan not joined by blood, but by a common idea. A brotherhood of shadows executing their own form of justice. In my time with them, they shared many of their most hidden secrets. The Assassin's Creed. And now, I gift one of these secrets to you. A weapon for the finest warrior I know. Beautiful craftsmanship. What kind of smith makes a weapon like this? It is less a weapon than a tool. One we have used for centuries to fight injustice and evil. <coughs> Mentor, I must protest. This is deeply unorthodox. Our wrist plate is a sacred tool. Do not tool. make a fetish out of cold metal, Haifa. What matters is the mind of the one who wields it. Please, try it on. The blade should ride on the underside of your arm, to conceal it from your target. I have no wish to hide this, and I would rather not make the same mistake you two have. I like it. This is no mistake. This is a voluntary sacrifice to prove our devotion to... A good start, Eivor. But you must learn how to use it effectively. Outside. This is not something for all eyes. Lead on. Wait a <laughs> This clan of yours, it has a name? Indeed. But among the tenants of our creed, is a vow to never reveal too much to outsiders. In time, you may learn more. Not here. 
where the walls and trees may have ears. I look forward to it. Here, let me lead you through our most basic techniques. Wielded with skill and care, our blade delivers a singular killing blow. As you near your target, find your window to strike. Timing is essential. Nicely done. I have not seen a blade so sharp. Some targets are trickier than others. Keep that in mind before you strike. A decent attempt. Take that one down from the ledge. From the ledge? What do you mean? What? Hang it from a ledge. Hang it from a ledge. Where's the ledge? Hang it from a ledge. Is there a latch near? Up there? Maybe. Climb. Fuck do I get up there? Doesn't he climb? I'm trying. from a ledge thing. Ledge assassination. a challenge. Leap down upon that target from above. Leap down on the target from above. <laughs> oh, maybe I need to get up higher. Mm -hmm. 
Exactly. Yeah. Just like that. Use your surroundings when possible. Strike from that haystack, for instance. Haystack. Behind him. A perfect strike. Mentor, does Eivor intend to join us? Not that I am aware. Then why offer him the blade? Surely we have more... Python. Hush. You wield the blade well. Let us leave Eivor to enjoy his gift in peace. Come. Eivor, let us walk to the docks and take in the night air. Okay. What do you make of my new friends? They seem generous and menacing in equal measure. I know what you mean. They have learning to. They wield numbers and writing as if it were magic. Basim has shown me so much about the world, all of which I will share with you when the time is right. Oh, I miss the smell of this land. Okay, I learned a little bit right for there. Good. Or do you mean to join this Shadow Brotherhood? Leave all that aside, Ivor. Tonight we are family again. The here and now is what matters. Our kinship. Our clan. Our glory. I missed you, brother. Your clear head and your courage. We have not had enough of both in recent months. <laughs> you flatter me, Wolfkist. Keep it up. <laughs> From here to Valhalla, I will always be on your side, Sigurd. Always. This fjord has grown too small to contain me, or I too large. There is so much more beyond these stony fangs that rise around us. England, Ireland, Francia, all greener pastures, ripe for the plucking. Tomorrow, we make new war on Goethe and reclaim the lands he took from us. And from there, we build a kingdom for us. I'm with you. Only say the word. Good. Get some rest, and return here at first light. I think that's a good stopping place. All right. Well, guess what, y'all? That looks like a good have spoken. spot will for us oh, to take a break. Wrong. That cannot be right. Uh -uh. Odin fought against his fate. It Hold can on. be done. You uh. will betray Sigurd. Shit. Kjotve's warriors. All right, so we're going to stop right there. Uh, we hope you enjoyed playing this with us, and, or watching us play. And uh, please like if you do like it, and we'll continue on. Um, so uh, like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one. Thanks, All bye. right, thanks.